Uh, I was thinking about my family and my friends whose names are on the Vietnam War Memorial. <coughs> And it was just so beautiful to see the flags waving together because that means that they did not die in vain and that we are still oh my fighting for freedom. And we still need to, I, I want to thank Congressman Lowenthal and our Congress people that are really keeping this issue on the national level because we really, really need that. And we also need to not remember, or excuse me, not forget those that are currently fighting in Vietnam for freedom and for the people that are trying to escape and are in Thailand right now that don't have any status whatsoever. We have to support them. And lastly, as I look around here, you know, I want to thank our veterans, but you know, as I look at you, a lot of them are a lot older, and I hope that we can have a memorial. Excuse me. I hope that we can have a memorial for our Vietnamese veterans, like we have Arlington and Washington. have the, um, I believe they've, they've started it out in San Bernardino, and um, they're purchasing, you know, the land. But we really, really need that because it has to stay alive, you know, for our children so that they do not forget. And anyway, thank you for being here. Congressman Alan Lorenzo, please come up.